I, I want to circle back to that point uh, and toward the end of the program. Let's stick with the, the oil for one more question, if you don't mind, Pavel. Uh, Biden has has warned the American public that gas prices are going to rise and could rise significantly in the United States. I mean, how do you convey the message that that whatever uh, that this price is worth it, if, if indeed you think it is? I think early on uh, at the onset of this war in Ukraine, the United States um, thought that it could distance itself or maybe isolate itself uh, from this conflict. And I think that's a mistake. What's at stake in Europe right now is more than simply the lives and liberties of the Ukrainian people. They are the ones paying the cost with their blood, but what they're defending is more than their life and freedom. They're also defending the rest of the Europe and the democratic values against those values of autocracy, if such can be said uh, about autocratic, despotic regimes, such as the one of Vladimir Putin in Russia. They're acting as live shield for the rest of the world right now. So I think the people in the United States are starting to see that. They're starting to understand that the fight in the Ukraine is more than just a regional conflict. and as we've seen in some of the polling, the people in the US, even though they're seeing higher gas prices, uh, are willing to make that economic sacrifice to fight for democracy. Yeah, very good point. 